All right. Oh, wind wise, this is the best day we're gonna be down in Key West. What is up y'all? Welcome to a new video. Kelsey is over here with the kayak ready to get in. Got my kayak loaded up. All right, we got the palm trees. It is a beautiful day. Y'all will finally get to see the water and we're gonna hopefully see some cool stuff in the water and catch some cool stuff. I don't wanna talk too much. Let's get out there. Welcome to a new video. This is gonna be freaking. This is what I've been waiting for right here. Cool. 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 All right, just paddled out. I wanna show you guys this real quick. This is freaking sick. So this is just the start of it. And this is like right by the resort we're staying at. This is a little aqua park. And uh, it is just freaking gorgeous water. We're gonna be able to see hopefully lots of cool stuff, lots of cool fish. It's a little bit windy, but not too windy. This is so cool. Holy. Hopefully we can catch something. Yeah, it's definitely shallow right here. I really hope this comes through clear on the camera. Y'all can see this, man. Rudder out. Pedals down. Oh yeah. Should've got a rope so I could tell you. <laughs> this is freaking, I hope y'all can see this, man. Oh man. If you see a giant shark swim under you, you're just gonna see it. Woo! So uh, this was the bridge I was fishing. We are gonna just do a lot of exploring, hopefully see some cool fish, and hopefully catch something. I have a rod and we have a bunch of artificial lures. Giant pelican right there. As I said, this is like our only day really probably to get out in the kayaks, just cause like, they said it's been windy the past three weeks here. And I guess usually it's even clearer than this, but it takes a while for the seas to calm down after the wind because we're like in the ocean and stuff they're saying. But the next couple of days is supposed to get significantly windier. So today is the day to capitalize on this and have some nice yak in action. This is really what I wanted to do down here, man. I'm, I'm really happy we got to do this. Wow. Skirt. Anything big down there? Any snapper? There's some fishing line dangling off the bridge. Oh, this is cool. I'm just going to take a cast while we're just coming through here. This is a spot I, I couldn't even hit the other day. Wow, it's so clear. The water. The water is so clear. Under a bridge. Wow. Okay, one more cast over here. I have a, a little paddle tail on and a one quarter ounce jig head. Whoa. The big kahuna. The big boat just waved us. Whoa, whoa. It really dropped off right here. I think, I kind of want to troll something, but you're behind my butt. <laughs> you're past me real quick. I'm gonna troll this little swim bait down there. I'm just kind of down for anything like I'll, I'll literally catch whatever bites or whatever swimming but I would love to catch a grouper a tarp and it would be insane to hook up on uh, snook maybe some more different kinds of snapper maybe some jack there's like a golden jack down here which apparently is like one of the most prized eating fish and it looks so freaking cool but there's just so many different types of fish it's, it's actually kind of insane it's so freaking cool. There's a blimp over there too. I don't, what is, like what even is a blimp? See this is like pristine right here. What are these like mounds of sand? Holy crap. What on earth? This wind is pushing me. It's like super shallow. Holy crap, it is so shallow. I'll take anything as I said that bites me. I'll take a barracuda. I got some shrimp imitation lures too. Whew, 
This is insane. I mean, I'm sure, y'all yeah, could probably tell, like, I don't really know what I'm exactly doing. Is this where I want to be targeting? Why are there sand mounds? There can also be crocodiles here, too. I don't know if I mentioned that, but that's a little spooky. Oh. 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 I think I'm just going to focus on, I guess, sight fishing right now, and then also trying to hit the mangrove line. I feel like mangroves always hold fish. But also, I have no clue what I'm doing. Oh, I just got bit by something. What was that? Oh, I see it. Wait, what was that? First bite of the day. I uh, I don't know. I've been kind of throwing shrimp around the past couple of days just because the weather's been so like not ideal in terms of like the wind and stuff. Even today, I'm getting blown around a little bit, but it's still like this is as good as it's gonna get. This is pretty good. But yeah, it's just been so windy that I, I've just uh, kind of been using live bait. So today I really, really want to catch some stuff on artificial. It's kind of my goal here. I probably could have caught something already with some shrimp. But my goal also is too that maybe we'll catch something a little bit cooler with like something like this. Just like bass fishing, I guess. I just hit the. Oh, I got bit. I was gonna say I just hit the shade line. <laughs> this is amazing. I can't even imagine like a day with no wind. We're going to have to make a trip back here. Plan it around like the windiness. Wow. This is just amazing. Sight fishing is so cool, but I think it's going to take a little bit more than that. Because I don't, I don't think I have the Key West. Oh, I just spooked a big fish. What the frick? I was going to say, I don't have the Key West fish eye yet. <laughs> What was that? Oh, I see it. Oh, that's a tree. Is that a barracuda? That's the tree again. Oh, it's a little deeper right here. Look at this. That was definitely, I think it was a barracuda. I don't know if I've ever caught a barracuda. Shark, 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 shark. Can y'all see that? Freaking shark, dude. I think it's a nurse shark, I believe. That is a freaking, whoa. <laughs> what? I'm literally fishing in an aquarium. Well, I've learned over the years that mangroves are not my friend, so probably don't want to cast into them anymore today if we could try to not do that. But we switched over to this little shrimp dude. First time I ever used this. I think it's a voodoo shrimp. It's a name brand. Usually I stick with the gulp and stuff, but this one it just looks so like lifelike and realistic. And I feel like in this territory 
of super clear water and all that. Maybe this is something you want. Okay, so my GoPro literally died. And I took one more cast by the mangroves with this little shrimp dude. And this dude came off ripping it. This is, I believe, my first ever barracuda. I don't even know if I want to put him in the net, really. I don't want him to get all slimy. Apparently, they're super slimy and stinky. Um, where is... Here it is. Okay. <sighs> Big freaking teeth. Okay. <sighs> On the shrimp. Did you destroy my shrimp? Hopefully not. This guy has some crazy teeth. This is some of the craziest fish teeth I've ever seen. I'll tell you what, too. That guy was not going nowhere. Ooh, my first ever barracuda, I believe. Look at the teeth. Oh my gosh. I mean, that guy shot off like a rocket too. I wouldn't mind catching some more of those. Hopefully he didn't like destroy my shrimp. Awesome. <sighs> All right, let's let him go. Big old freaking teeth. All right, you good, buddy? Hello? <gasps> oh, that's a freaking, is that a little hammerhead shark right there? You guys just see that? That was a shark of some sort. And that was freaking cool. I wish you guys could have seen the fight. That thing ran. I thought it was a snook. All right. How good is this doing? You okay, buddy? There we go. Good as new shrimp. I've come to terms with the fact that this might not be the best place to pedal drive kayak. Look at all this crap that gets stuck here. Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Look at this. I'm getting thrown. Maybe before it gets too crazy, I'm going to hit up that other side and just paddle along that way and meet up with Kelsey. This is just pushing me this way. Whoa, look at the water over here. This is freaking, oh my gosh, dude. There's like some houses on the water over here too, man. This, uh, I can't even imagine how expensive those are. All right, mission, get to the other side. We're like almost halfway there, halfway there. I see some docks, I see some structure. There's like a canal over here. This is where stuff's gonna happen. Ooh, just look at these houses though. We are ninjas. Oh, there's a canal back here. There's a fish. There's a fish. Another little one. Oh, please tell me you didn't destroy my shrimp. Little one. Wow. Very little. <laughs> oh, that one has cool spots on it. Is that a different kind of barracuda? Good chill, buddy. I don't want no problems. Look at that. See the spots on the top of them there? Is that a different breed? Or do they just have different spots? Or different, not breed, yeah. Species? Thank you, buddy. Cool. Well, first catch on camera. Just tossing it by the little mangroves over here. I'm thinking the canals are gonna be where it's at, man. Yeah, I don't know, let me know. I have a feeling that just juvenile uh, barracuda like that have spots like that. I might be wrong though. Anybody hanging out over here that I can't see very well? Oh, that was a big barracuda. <laughs> oh my god.
What is that? What is that? That is not a... Wait, what is that? Oh, cool. Oh, second species of the day. He hit it, then he came back for it. Come around this side. Whew. That is a snapper. Another fish that will probably destroy our shrimp if given the chance. He might just do it, actually. Dude, that's a keeper mangrove right there. Look at that. Freaking choked it. Oh, jeez. Okay, he's good. Oh, no, my tip. I got to put a new shrimp on. Dang it. Well, it was worth it. He halved my shrimp, though. Again, look at this, man. 10.09. Two shrimps. I got to start selling some freaking shrimps. <laughs> Five bucks a pop, pretty much. Craziness. You thought gas prices were high. Pretty toothy. Pretty warm, pretty windy. Let's see if we get some more. Anything not toothy out there? I don't know, man. Are snook here? Or do they not come down this far in Florida? Or am I just like not catching them? Or am I not in the right area? Probably not in the right area. Probably all of the above, honestly. I'm surprised how good the shrimp lure actually works, though. I wonder if I had the gulp shrimp on if it'd be doing as good. But we are getting pushed around. Where the heck is Kelsey? Kelsey told me to come down this way. This is just a canal. This looks like such good fishing. She said there's a bunch of jellyfish down here. And I'm already seeing a few. They're like weird looking jellyfish. I have no clue what kind. I don't want to get stung though. Ooh. Yeah, no. I wouldn't mind owning one of these. Oh my god. No, something just clocked me. Oh. Dude, there's so many fish right there. Well, that was really cool. I saw giant schools of parrotfish. What is that floating around? A little barracuda? Yeah, I've never seen parrotfish in big schools like that. They were big too. I think you need like bait bait to catch parrotfish though. All right, let's take a look at what we're working with. We're on our way back towards this bridge. That's a nice shady spot right there. Nobody home? Here we go. Oh man. 
What are these, snapper? They get like ultra aggressive and just go crazy. And I think they kind of realize like, oh, that's, that's a dude with a fake shrimp. Just well.